play yesterday. This is an older story, but I never saw this one, but this guy asked me to play this one just Like so many of us have done before, this story starts with a meetup to carry out an online sale, but it took just an awful turn, leading to a brutal beating and violent sexual assault all in front of a one-year-old. The incident itself lasted about 20 minutes uh, from start Damn. to finish. In that short time, so much pain inflicted. Investigators say at the hands of 29-year-old Javon Anderson. Uh -oh. In total, there are 26 different charges that uh, were Applied. That's 26 felonies for Anderson for what happened at these Northville Township apartments off 8 Mile near Silver Spring Drive on January 20th, where the victims lived. Sources say Anderson came to make an online buy, luring the seller outside where he was badly beaten, then forced into his own home at gunpoint. Anderson allegedly held a gun to the man and his one-year-old child while he violently sexually assaulted the child's mother. In my 17-year experience. Golly, I mean, yeah. damn, Javon. Yeah, like, right. what the fuck, yo, yo? Yo, yo, Krug, did you see the one yesterday with the with the rapists by any chance? Krug? Nah, nah. Which one? Yeah, yo, let, let me. Long story short, there was a son, a son man, like a nineteen year old, that raped a son, sixty year old, for three hours, bro, killed him. He died from his injuries from being raped for three hours. Those in public. Oh, that's crazy. No, I didn't see that one. It was yesterday we came across it. <laughs> yeah, it I, crazy. I gotta chop that one up. But yeah. Hey, listen, <laughs> man. <laughs> I forgot about that one too, man. But listen, man. Listen. Yo, it, yeah, when you put that one in context with this one. Yeah, it's not so bad. <laughs> different nah, don't get me wrong. Yeah, this is different behavior. Yo, show me. Show me other groups doing this like in public I mean, like in, in, in public show yeah, me this I mean, show me this you, you know what man I'll, I'll give the sun man a break on this one because i feel like other groups do can't do this <laughs> so i'll give him a break on this one the fuck are you talking about yeah i mean men will men will attack women and rape them right in public they'll snatch them and rape them they it happens right it's not just the sun man doing that have you looked at the numbers on that no, do you know him by any chance? Yeah, it's like <laughs> fucking thousands to one. Mm, okay, I stand corrected. I let tried to let me refresh you, man. I think you I think you didn't hear what actually happened. Man. Let me give you let me give you guys a refresh. Inflicted. Investigators say at the hands of 29-year-old Javon Anderson. In total, there are 26 different charges that uh, were applied. That's 26 felonies for Anderson for what happened at these Northville Township apartments off 8 Mile near Silver Spring Drive on January 20th, where the victims lived. Sources say Anderson came to make an online buy, luring the seller outside where he was badly beaten, then forced into his own home at gunpoint. Anderson allegedly held a gun to the man and his one-year-old child while he violently sexually assaulted the oh, child's okay. mother. My 17-year experience here, this is a very abnormal incident. Mm -hmm. uh, it's, it's an isolated incident. The family was targeted, then Anderson took off, stealing something from them, too. Northville Township Police enlisting the help of the feds, state police, and a task force in Canton to track Anderson down. Well, there was surveillance that was conducted uh, both electronically and physical over the course of a two-week period. On Monday, an FBI-led SWAT team arrested him hold up at an apartment in Taylor. Another person was arrested too, who was involved. That poor family, both mom and dad, were treated at the hospital, then released. So the victims are okay. Uh, obviously they hate um, uh, My man, they're not okay. <laughs> 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 I don't mean to like, you know, bust and, bust As a man, man though, <laughs> though, as a husband, I, right. if, yo, if you let some shit like that happen to your wife in front of you, bro, like how though? Like how um, can you bounce back? Let me, let me let me put it like this. Let me put it like this, man. As a son, man, a, a son, man will have a hard time. You cussed at his wife in pub, like you at McDonald's, and there's a dispute over who in line, and you like, bitch. And a son, man, don't do nothing. He, he, he can't overcome that. Like, right. I don't overcome that. Yeah. <laughs> right. But you know, you know what, I, you know what I find impressive though, I, I mean. It, I'm impressed by the amount of like pain that the summit causes. Cause we've seen a lot of stories with the with, like with the gliders, right? And it's like boring. 
It's like just straight to yeah, it. it is but the song, the song words, man, they just like inflict suffering on people, man. Yeah, he 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 screwed like he had the gun on the baby. So that guy couldn't listen. As much as we say, oh, you should have did something. Fuck it. <laughs> he had the gun on the bed, and you have to, you got to admit this is after beating the husband to a pulp, right? At gun, so he beats the husband to a pulp, and then he puts the gun on the baby. The husband had to believe that he would shot the baby. Like it's one thing to be like, yeah, you ain't gonna shoot the baby. It's another thing that the look in Javon's eyes after he's beating you to a fucking bloody pulp. And to think that he wouldn't shoot your baby, right. I mean, I, 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 I gotta get this guy. Like, I think that he, he made the right decision. I think Javon would have shot the baby if he'd have went for it. Yeah, hundred. I think his first mistake was going on the marketplace with a song man. Mistake yeah, number exactly. one. That was that was his first. That was his only mistake. Salute right. to, um, <laughs> salute to um, Eric S. I. Base Hall of Fame for coming through once again. That was his only mistake. Um, because this, everything this else is like uh, <laughs> the guy in Baltimore that killed Pava. Remember, he did this before he killed Pava. Oh, yeah, he broke, exactly. in, he yeah. broke into the yeah. basement apartment and raped a girl with and held the guy at gunpoint. Yep, yep, wow, yeah, this is this is exactly what he did. Um, and then he set the house on fire, but they they didn't they survived. Um, oh. yeah. Yeah, this is actually this. Yeah, this isn't that uncommon. That like the, like the cop said, but um, in Canton to track Anderson down. Well, there was surveillance that was conducted uh, both electronically and physical over the course of a two-week period. On Monday, an FBI-led SWAT team arrested him, holed up at an apartment in Taylor. Another person was arrested too, who was involved. That poor family, both mom and dad, were treated at the hospital. Then released. So the victims are okay. Uh, obviously, they uh, they're going through a process and they went through a lot of trauma, which takes some healing. For those 26 felonies, Anderson is being held on a half a million dollar bond, no 10 percent. <laughs> as far as prior criminal history, he does have some gun charges on his record and felonies for writing bad checks. Reporting in Northfield Township, Jessica Dupnack on the Edge. So you want to hurt yourself or somebody else? Want to hurt the police? <laughs> Huh? Well, this is. Uh, so, you want to hurt yourself or somebody else? Want to hurt the police? Right. Is what you're saying? Fuck the police. So, you want to kill the police? Alright, put your hands on your back. No, look, no, look. Put your hands on your back. 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 Put your h